M3 CES and this was hands down the best G series that I have driven yeah we already did a lap because you can see the Sun is setting down we had to do a lap immediately because well uh, you will see everything in the intro but yeah G series G80 yeah G80 because the M3 it's not, not the M4 CES so with significantly a bit of lower weight different handling mods it is on cup 2 tires which are very good 550 horsepower all-wheel drive optionally with rear-wheel drive as well of course you can configure it that but my god the handling is exactly what I would be missing slightly on the non CS model I haven't driven the CSL yet but this made me really fall in love I'll say it throughout the video on the lap as well um, when I was saying about the M3 Touring I would love to wait for M3 CS Touring if it comes out because that I think is going to be the great car after having driven this this pretty much confirmed this is the best G series the best M3 that I have driven so thank you so much for the kind owners that let me experience it and uh, it was fantastic a bit of traffic but wow well, that was a very expensive lap in terms of now I definitely want to have a CS Touring but yeah when it comes if it comes because until then we have bought something else maybe it's already announced by the time this video gets released anyway enjoy the lap yes quarter to seven last car on track fantastic alrighty uh, sports 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 ah red light it's close behind us Perfect. So, apologize for dirty windscreen because, well, we really, as you can see, we were literally the last car on track, so I didn't have time to clean it. But for the rest, welcome into BMW M3 CS. So.
I love it. Yes. I love it. It's different. Can, is it fully stock? Yes, it's fully stock. It's amazing. Yes. Yes. This is perfectly. This is uh, like I said. I wanted like to buy M3 CS Touring if it's gonna come out because I think they would be like perfect. And this is perfect for the track. Like for this track, it's power enough, really sharp steering, still soft and comfortable. It's fantastic. It's also usable for daily. Very. Yeah. yeah. Heb je die laatste stuk opgenomen? Nee, hè? Ja, ja, alles is al oh, opgenomen. Okay. Ja, quick verdict, as I said already, this is for me the best BMW G model I have driven ever. I haven't driven the CSL, so I cannot make my judgment based on that. But CSL is three wheel drive only, I believe. Yeah, yes. yes. So uh, in that case, this could be more beneficial to uh, yeah to have more handling on track. 
and as we could have seen also with uh, Christian Gebhardt's Sport Auto Super Test with the stock G80 M4, the X Drive version was one second per lap faster. Uh, so there is definitely probably like the, the negligence of heavier weight on the front and a bit of understeer. The all-wheel drive uh, M Sport uh, mode or like yeah, well, whatever you want to call it, X Drive M. Uh, works very nicely and this car like I said wow like the brakes are on top the the handling the, the weight you even don't feel it even with three people in the car fantastic I'm really really impressed I'm happy we made it to be the last ones on track uh, but if we wouldn't have I wouldn't know what I was missing but now as mentioned before I definitely want to have a M3 CS Touring so who knows we'll see we'll see <laughs>